Lastly, come and sit down on the chair. What I'd like you to do is cross your right ankle over your left leg so that you can fit your fingers between each of your toes. Once you've got your fingers in between your toes, you're just going to start to move the toes and the ankles up and down. This is going to be more specific to some of the smaller joints in the foot and within the ankle, depending on how much movement you want. Let's start to move that ankle in a circular motion, reversing the direction, going the other way, and then actually taking the foot and doing some rotations to get in there a little bit more specifically. This feels very nice. A couple more circles. So with the fingers between the toes, we're spreading the joints more apart and potentially you might even feel a bit of a stretch in between those long bones of the foot, the metatarsals. And then we're getting into more of the tarsal bones when we're doing some of the up and the down, some of the rotation in a circle of the ankle, but then also the rotation and twisting of the foot. So go ahead and release your fingers from your toes. Give your foot a little move and shake around. And let's switch to the other side. So go ahead, let's get those fingers in between your toes again. And this might feel really weird. Um, you might not be used to touching your feet like this. Uh, just go with what you're comfortable and get your fingers in there as much as you can. All right, so let's just start with the fingers in, just bending through the toes, maybe starting to get the ankle involved. Let's get into some ankle circles. Couple one way, couple another way. And when you're ready for some twists of the foot. So I'm really having to use the back of, well, I guess the palm of my hand on the sole of my foot to help with some of that rotation through the foot. Let's get into some ups and downs, some circles both ways and the other way. Some twists, kind of whatever just feels good. When you're ready, release the fingers from your toes, maybe some ankle circles, spread the toes, curl them up, move the ankle around, see how it feels after all of that feels pretty darn good. And if you have some time, go ahead and grab a little bit of lotion and you could get into some foot massage by just coming, keeping your thumb straight and close towards your other fingers and just going and being a bit more specific in terms of some massage through the sole of your foot, on the top of your foot, even into the back of your ankle over your Achilles tendon or the front of your shin. If you've got an extra little bit of time, foot massage or even just rubbing your foot without any lotion can just be another thing that feels great and invigorating and really wakes up your feet.